Oh, let me get this straight. For a second round pick this year and a sixth round pick next year. <laughs> you, you, of course, you got to take on the salary too and salary cap implications. Da, 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 da. But for a second round pick this year and a sixth round pick next year, that gets you a Khalil Mack. Basically a second round pick. That's it. Basically a second round pick. So the Chargers, they, they traded away those draft picks to acquire one Khalil Mack. So you got Joey Bosa coming on one side. Then you got Khalil Mack coming on the other side. And last year, even in a, what was a down year for Khalil Mack, since uh, the production hasn't been quite there ever since he first got to Chicago, it just it's been dropping off slowly every year. Uh, because we see in the beginning of his career with the Raiders, 2014, he had four sacks. But then in 2015, he had 15 sacks. Then he had 11 sacks. Then he had 10 and a half sacks. Uh, so then in 2018, he got traded to the Bears. He had 12 and a half sacks. So he came out high. He was like, hey, these Raiders, they try to get rid of me. Now what? 12 and a half sacks on him. Uh, but then in 2019, he had eight and a half. And then 2020, he had nine. And then last year, he had six. So um, having Joey <laughs> This is so annoying because the AFC just been moving. They have been moving, especially like the AFC West. Of course, the Broncos, they getting Russell Wilson. So that was a nice little pickup for them. Um, and now the Chargers getting a, a Khalil Mack. But let them mess around and get some interior pressure too. It'll be filthy. It'll be filthy. And I, I can almost guarantee you, might have to come back to this video after the season, but I can almost guarantee you that Khalil Mack this year, especially if they get some more interior pressure, I can almost guarantee you that Khalil Mack eats. He feasts. I'm saying, I'm saying at least, mm, I'm going to go nine and a half, ten sacks. And I know some people will be like, oh, that's not feasting. Well, based off his past couple of years, it might be. But I, I think, well, no, hold on, we got 17 games. So you know what? Give me 12 sacks. 12 sacks. For Khalil. And the reason I say that is because you, you just got traded, so you get a fresh start. You could be like, oh, I feel the best that I felt in years. Da, da, da. You say all that good stuff. But then on top of that, you, you got Joey Bosa on the other side. You got a really good pass rusher opposite of you. So that makes your life easier. So there are going to be times when they double you and he gets to feast off of that. But there are going to also be times where they double him and you get to feast off of it. Ooh, so I guess that's the going price for a pass rusher nowadays. Um, NFL, this has been a crazy couple of days and free agency ain't even get started yet. We ain't even in the new league year yet. New league year starts on Wednesday. And all this craziness has happened already. Just imagine how it's going to be. <laughs> we out. <laughs>